here at Impact, we seek to bring together young, talented, ambitious people who want to make a difference in their local communities. And to do that, we want to equip them with an understanding of the key issues, the resources that can help them get there, and the network of folks that will ultimately do that. Immigration is a fundamental issue right now in our time. It's driving an election, and what Impact wanted to do for this topic, Impact Borders, was bring the conversation one level down into more of an understanding of what is the issue, what are the goals, what are the problems, what are the facts, and give our audience, give our panelists, give our community a better understanding to make a difference. When you frame immigration as an economic issue, I think you often are glossing over what is really behind that. There's a fear of changing demographics. Waves of migration, for example, from Mexico or Nicaragua or parts of Central America are really the direct result of U.S. foreign and economic policies within these regions. So over the past 20, 30 years, the economy has drawn these 11 million people, and there was no way for them to come legally. They absolutely had no choice. It wasn't like they just didn't want to do the legal way because they were tricky. They had no choice. There was no legal way. Why is there not more common understanding of the problem itself? One thing I think we might be able to find some common ground on is how can we provide safety for as many people as possible? How can we do that? It has to do with race, it has to do with all kinds of things, and we just need to be very careful not to just keep throwing that immigration band-aid on. You know, I think all of us uh, heard some things tonight from each other that can kind of help us uh, move things forward. I think if we break it down maybe and work on issue by issue instead of trying to um, reform all of immigration law in one fell swoop, that that might actually get us somewhere. One of the things that I think I've been most distressed by on the national level with immigration is just the fact that it feels like we can't actually have a conversation about this issue without everybody turning red in the face and being really angry. And so one of the values, I think, of the New York Impact event was that we talked about a complex, important topic, but did so in a respectful and civil manner.